Next? Yep. Okay, you can go in it. All right. Good afternoon, school board. I really appreciate you taking time out of your busy days to listen to me. I've come to speak to you all about how I think that HSC high school students and teachers would both benefit if they were motivated through the form of cash payments. By a show of hands, how many of you have ever been given a reward to do something? All right, thank you. And did this make you more motivated to do whatever it was? All right, cool. And when I asked HSC math teacher, Mr. Golden, for his thoughts, he said, I do believe positive incentives for performance should be used. He feels it would motivate students more. Uh, the lack of motivation is something that I've noticed a lot of in our school. Apparently, other people have noticed lack of motivation in their own schools. As 560 schools have begun handing out cash as a form of motivation. I will now talk more about the problem, how to solve it, and how it will change our school system for the better. Uh, success will increase if uh, teachers and students at HSC are paid. As I stated earlier, the problem I see in our school is a lack of motivation. There could be many reasons for this, such as if a student plays a sport or has a job which would take up time. The time that is being taken away would lead to less chance of schoolwork getting done or tests being studied for. Another, another uh, source of the lack of motivation would be senioritis, which is something you guys might have heard of. According to Merriam-Webster's dictionary, it's an ebbing or diminish of motivation and effort by school seniors as evidenced by tardiness, absences, and lower grades. This is the result of graduation already being assured. I had the chance to talk to HSC senior Jackson Howard and he said, many seniors have jobs, it's hard to stay motivated on many blow up classes. The senioritis problem needs to be addressed at HSE because in some cases, it will, it will result in colleges telling students they can no longer attend that school. These problems in our school are common. However, as I said earlier, many high schools nationwide are resolving them. Now that you all are aware of the problems, I would like to propose a solution that has been effective for many schools. This will result uh, uh. HSC students and teachers should be paid cash incentives as motivation for better performance. This will result in students com completing more schoolwork with more time invested into it if they know they will be rewarded. A case I found in research was Stafford School District in Virginia, which not only increased grades, but they also more than doubled the number of AP tests given. The reward that was given to these teachers and students was $100 for each passing grade. The total amount of money that was given out for the AP test in the Stafford School District was $136,170, according to Jay Matthews of the Washington Post. This article was what gave me the idea that teachers should also be paid for the students' successes, and Jackson Howard agrees. He says, teachers should receive benefits because high test scores means great teaching. The solution that I propose to you will lead to other benefits that are not directly related to school performance. Such benefits include students making money that could someday go towards paying for college tuition, or it will prepare them for the future where they will have to know how to spend money in order to be financially secured. Mr. Golden says that it will also lead to the development of a strong work ethic and positive behaviors that carry over into most other aspects of life. The money paid to teachers could go towards classroom improving the classrooms. As you can see, there are many benefits, and they show that this system will prepare the young people of HSC for the real world. I've now told you all of my reasons for believing that everyone would benefit from students and teachers being paid for success. I shared information with you through interviews with an HSC student and teacher, and even articles from people that have studied the topic for years. From my research, I know that people have been in your shoes at one point, but they eventually figured out that paying students is the right way to go. This subject is very important and will have a huge impact on the HSC school district and everyone a part of it, as it will prepare students for success later in life better than ever. I now ask you all to please consider the idea of paying students and teachers in order to increase academic performance in our school. You have a chance to improve our school, school system 
and join the hundreds of other schools who are already participating in this movement. Will you decide to join them or be left behind? Thank you for your time. Have a nice day.